All right, as I said, I put on the C-clamp earlier to compress that... Oh, I did it again. I put on the C-clamp earlier to compress that pad onto the caliper because if you don't, the added new thickness will not allow you to place it on the rotor itself. It slides right over like that. I've cleaned off the brake rotor with a special solvent made for that purpose. A lot of times they come packed. They come packed in a gel for protection. This one didn't seem to have any on there, but I sprayed it nonetheless. I also place one tire lug nut on the rotor to hold it in place. It's just something I do because if you don't and you try to mount the caliper, the the rotor, this guy here, will will start flipping a little bit and it makes it just a pain in the butt to try to get things locked on. All right. I have one more pad to put on the the spring ver the spring version the one with the spring on it was the most difficult actually of the two to put on and now I'm ready to put in the second one which as I said earlier goes in surprisingly easy just like that and I'm gonna connect this up here okay. I'm going to try to do this with one hand. I don't know how successful I'm going to be, but if I'm not, then I'll just show you. Mm -hmm. Yeah, that should go on easy. Of course, I have my my clothes hanger in the one place it shouldn't be. So I'm going to shut the recorder off for a second. Actually, I can keep it. I'll shut it off. Stop. And 